Jarl's been asking to talk to you. You have AVP Outstanding Pathfinder. Hi there. Just checking in. What's up? Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Hey, Jal. <laughs> Didn't mean to scare you. What? Uh, I'm I'm not scared. Uh, one second. What's going on in here? You look busy. If I'm busy, my mind is occupied with whatever I'm working on, uh, rather than worrying. Whatever gets you through. Uh, I'd like your advice on something. I'm making gifts for everyone. I have a list. Gifts? Hmm. Do Purians like poetry? For Vetra, I'm writing a poem and engraving it on... Uh, well, I, I'm not sure yet. She's a Turian. She might like something a little more hands-on. Hmm. Good to know. I'll think about that. Uh, Liam seems to like my Rothjin. I might sew him one. He does. Do Krogan like knives? I could craft a ceremonial Angaran dagger for Drac. Who wouldn't want that? It's mainly decorative. Would you like one? Jal, this is a lot of work. What's really going on? I'm sure that I seem confident and skilled to you, but I'm not. Or I don't feel like I am. I feel like that a lot. <laughs> Good to know. Yes, thanks for sharing that. Just be yourself. My family is well known. Our lineage is respected. And many of my kin have achieved great things. I've never been one of them. So many older siblings and cousins who succeeded at everything. I stopped trying to keep up. Right. Thanks for listening. You're not in anyone's shadow here. I believe in you. Pathfinder. The trap you set in the cargo bay, we got blip. I think something's in there. So the 
Centurions kick out the genophage, basically destroy our people, and they get a pat on the back and a seat on the council. And what do I get? A medal. A medal? From who? My buddy. Made one out of a piece of scrap and pinned it to my chest. Still got it somewhere. Hi there. You must be the one eating all our cereal. Hey, it's okay. No one's going to eat you. You're the most adorable critter I've met in Andromeda so far. I should find you somewhere safer than our cargo bay. How about a nice warm cage in my quarters and all the cereal you can eat? Guess everybody around here needs a home. Orbiting Kadara. Stars are born out here. Anomaly detected. Probes launched. Anomaly found. Anomaly on sensors. Deploying probe. 
we've got a crater. Wow. Look at all this. The Scourge did a number here, didn't it? To think this was supposed to be the Turian home, now the Exiles have taken over. Cosmic radiation is off the charts, Ryder. You'll need to stay in the Nomad. What good are these fancy suits if they don't block radiation? In normal situations, they do. This planet's magnetic field was disrupted when it cracked open. No protection from a cosmic ray tearing you apart at the molecular level. So, stick to the Nomad. Descent engine engaged. Good luck, Ryder. I met your sister on the Nexus. She's really... Chatty, bouncy, irritating. Yeah. I don't know anyone like that. She said you raised her? Well, I tried. She was a handful. What was it? Just... Gravity's lower than we're used to, Pathfinder. Gil says you shouldn't worry about accidentally hitting escape velocity. <laughs> that sounds like a challenge. What does that mean? Ryder, tell, tell me you're not. B but Gil... So cute when she's flustered. Inside. What about the crazy space radiation? The dome structure prevents cosmic rays from entering. Exiles, heads up! Exiles everywhere. What would they want with this place? Pathfinder, I detect a data pad nearby. It may provide answers. They're mining? Helium-3? The main component in shuttle fuel pathfinder. It can also be used to make highly effective explosives. Just what we need. Exiles with explosives. Let's get into that base.
The attached passcode is only a fragment. Data here indicates other mining domes. I've added the locations to your map. The data pad we found mentioned a guy named Krex. Any idea who that is? Doesn't ring a bell. If he's out here, he might be dangerous. Peeled, everyone. Don't worry, I'm not blinking. If there's something to see, I'm gonna see it. You'll see. Maybe look with your eyes, not your mouth, huh? Looks like the exiles made themselves at home.
second dome requires a passcode pathfinder. Ryder won't let anyone else drive this thing, right? What? You've driven this thing? Who else? I is it everyone else? Oh, never mind. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Don't look down, guys. Everything that went wrong here, that's quite a view. Think I need to apologize, Vetra. Now? Yeah. See, I had an older sister. 500 years older. By the time I was self-aware, she was already a matriarch. In other words, I had two mothers, and they tag-teamed, trying to raise me right. Well, Sid and I had no parents, and someone had to be responsible. I get it. That's why I apologized. I doubt you do. <sighs> According to Sid's intel, that's where those settlers are being held. We should check it out. I do not detect life in our immediate vicinity. Let's head in, but stay sharp. My sister may have missed something in her... Looks like no one's home. I swear, if Sid sent us on a pointless search, I'm going to drill her shin plates. Move! Go! <laughs> Ah! 
What the hell was that? Did I land on you? Sorry. Ah, Nix. So good to finally meet you. And you brought friends. That's even the Pathfinder, if I'm not mistaken. My bait worked better than expected. The missing settlers. Who are you? Why are you kidnapping innocents? Innocents? <sighs> They're criminals. You help them get away from me. You think I'm gonna let that go? Get comfortable. You'll be here a while. Case of mistaken identity? I'm just as lost as you are. It's okay, Vetra. You don't have to cover for us. That was Meriwether. She runs a smuggling ring on Kadara. We worked for her. Vetra helped us get out of it. New lives, hiding in the outposts. So you're helping people. There was no need for all that modesty. It's not modesty. I didn't help anyone. Okay, okay. You didn't help anyone. I'm getting out of here. We've tried. There's no way out. There's always a way out. Ryder, you have to believe me. I've no idea what's going on. I'm going to get answers, but first we have to get out of here. Vetra seems really agitated. It's making me doubt what really happened. I, uh, I hope this all gets sorted out soon. There was some mention of you being a Nexus exile? Yeah. I'm not proud of it. When we first got here, things were bad. Real bad. It was all too easy to start scapegoating the initiative. When the revolt happened, I joined. But things aren't better on Kadara. Or out there on your own. Thanks to Vetra, I got a second chance to do things right. I wish I knew what he was talking about. Tell me more about Meriwether. She used to be some kind of military surveyor. Now, she's a gang leader and smuggler. Working for her was all right at first. Then, uh, she started doing things we didn't agree with. But you don't just quit working for Meriwether. We needed someone to help hide us. Now, Meriwether's convinced we're scheming against her, or something. You said Vetra helped you. How exactly? Some of us were trying to get off Kadara. She must have heard about it through contacts. She reached out to us, made up assignments at the outposts. That got us free. We didn't meet her in person, only over comms. Maybe it was never really her. You think? Anyway, we thought Meriwether would let us go. We were wrong. Do you know what Meriwether plans to do with us? We were always bait for Vetra. Now that Vetra's here, Meriwether has no use for us. And for Vetra, most likely revenge. Meriwether doesn't care for people who meddle in her business. Nothing good in store for anyone, I'm certain. How did Meriwether get a base on this planet? She made friends on Kadara. Some Angarans who told her about this place. It was a mine or something. Got damaged and abandoned. It was perfect for Meriwether. She wanted to strike out on her own, away from Sloan. We put a lot of work into this place. Carved out a niche, doing things even Sloan won't touch. There'll be time to talk later. Controls are not accessible from here, Pathfinder. There has to be a way out. I 
can open the doors from my end, but they're powered down. We need to get them going again. Your end? Who are you? I don't like the sound of this, Ryder. Just get those doors some power! It appears functional. No way to know until we try. Now we just have to get this power flowing to that door. That cable's not going to get power to that door. These might connect the door to the generator. Everyone, in here! Are okay. Is everyone okay? Sidera Nix, you've been pretending to be me, haven't you? Uh, how did you? Think I don't recognize my own tricks? And stop using my voice. Sorry. It was just easier to get things done when people thought I was you. You know, because you have contacts and stuff. Sid. So you didn't help us, just like you said. It was... Yeah, my kid's sister. Give your sister some credit, Vetra. This wasn't exactly easy to pull off. Ryder, don't encourage her. Sid, I know you're in the facility somewhere. Get back in your shuttle and return to the Nexus. But I can help you get everyone out of here. You hacked a door without checking for safeguards. That's help we don't need. So walk me through it. I got eyes on the base. Ryder? If she can tell us what we're up against, that'll be a big help. See? Fine. But she has to follow my instructions. Can you do that, Sid? Yes, Vetra. We'll stay put and follow you when it's safe. Don't want to get caught in the crossfire. The sooner we get going, the better. Sid will alert us if anything's headed our way. Head down the corridor, through the mess hall. That's quickest. Before we go farther, are you in a safe spot? Yeah, I'm tapped into their system from outside. Shuttle's well hidden. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Did you know your sister was messing about in person? Hitting you? 
Do you think I would have let her if I knew? This explains a bunch of the strange reactions I've gotten from some of my associates. Shit. I have no idea what else she's done in my name. Sid, can you see the colonists? Yes, they're playing it safe, keeping the corners. I'll keep an eye on them, promise. Sid, we're going to need you to hack into systems to cause a disruption. Right. Only one. Get in and get out. Too much messing around and they'll track you down. I can send a surge of power to that generator. The electrical discharge from that could take out some of them. Heard we caught as a Pathfinder. That'll be a pretty ransom. If we don't get our brains plastered on the walls. That's not like... Sid, what's that door? Um, looks like it leads to some kind of workshop. Could be some gear in there. Any security? Yeah, loads. If I open the door, you'll have to deal with them. Ryder. Let's get into that workshop. I need to see what's in there. If you say so. Would you prefer they went after your friends? No, but... <sighs> Never mind. Take that passageway next. It'll take you through... Huh. It looks like a bunch of cages? What the hell is happening? Who's messing with security? Why are the feeds down? Someone answer me! Galloway, stay where you are. There's guards in the corridor right by you. They're moving on. Okay. Good. You're clear. Thanks, Sid. That was a close one. That's a lot of animals. They could be training them as a security measure. If they're still feral, they could soften up those guards for us. Then again, they might also attack us. Turrets. Those might be a problem. I could turn them off or change the attack protocols.
They have a fiend? I can't open that cage. Remote access is disabled. They probably don't want accidents. Turn those turrets on Meriwether's men. That should get them out of our way. Here we go. Talk to your sister about all this? Oh, you have no idea. Workshop next. That's the direct way out. There's a rat in the system. I want this rat caught. Double the rations for anyone that does it. Uh... 
I could dump out whatever's in those tanks. That stuff cuts right through shields. If we're not careful, that'll hurt both them and us. If that engine has a charged core, it might explode. Looks like you've got loads of options. Sid, can you fire up that engine? Let's blow them up. Ugh, that's gonna hurt. wanted you involved in the things I did. You can't have excitement and adventure if you can't handle pain and blood. Well, I guess it's straight through the door next. Sid, what do we have coming up? Sid? Uh, looks like... Sid? I think... I think someone found my shuttle. I can hear. I think I gotta... Oh no! Sid! Sid, come in! They found her. They're gonna kill her! Why'd you have to go be the hero, Sid? Stupid. So, so stupid. Sid's leverage. They won't kill her just yet. We just have to be quick. You're right. I think I can trace Sid's signal. Should take us to her. No time to waste, but we have to be careful. They have my sister. Watch out! They're coming straight for us!
You want your rat veteran Nix? You come to me. Help! Think carefully about your next move, Pathfinder. That explodes, it takes you out too. You won't let that happen. Vetra. It's going to be okay. We're gonna get you out of this. Okay. We're talking. Now what? Put your weapons on the ground. your shuttle. Are you all right? Are you hurt? I... I think I'm okay. Help's on the way. We're all good, thanks to you. <sighs> I didn't mean for any of this. I'm sorry, okay? 
You can't just mess around with people from Kadara. They're dangerous. I just... These guys wanted to start over, not be exiles anymore. No one else was giving them a chance, so I thought... I can do that. I can help. These are good people who made bad choices. Your sister did the right thing. She still should have talked to me. I don't want you hurt. There are ugly sides to what I do, and you shouldn't have to deal with them. You started out when you were my age, and you managed okay? That wasn't by choice. You saw what we did here. This isn't all fun and games, Sid. Yeah, I was shocked at first, but I understand now, and I can handle it. I don't want you to have to. Whatever. I'm going back to the Nexus, like you wanted. That was intense. Are you alright? Fine. I just need some time to think. Hey, at least the settlers are safe. Thanks for helping me out with this rider. Can we just get moving now?